Hey bosses and boss babes, welcome back to my channel. It's the original boss babe, Cleopatra, and I'm here with another video. Today we're gonna be doing my birthday try on haul. My birthday was a few days ago, and I bought myself a lot of stuff to celebrate my 30th birthday, so I just wanted to share that with you guys. So let's get right into it. The first thing that I got <clears throat> was this robe dress slash house coat. Um, it is a two piece. Mine is super dirty right now because it has been worn. This is something that I can wake up in the morning and put on just really quickly if I need to run through the house or I can wear it at night, you know, when I've settled down, I've washed my face and I'm, you know, ready to go to bed. Um, my husband really liked this piece the first time he saw it. The theme for this try on haul was definitely dresses. Um, I stay at home a lot, so um, I thought I would get myself some comfortable pieces um to you know hang out in the house in so the first piece is this silk nighty or uh i don't know dress um it's obviously you know something comfortable to wear in the house a lot of girls are wearing these now um with the the fuzzy slides and um they even wear them out to nightclubs um so i got this one in two colors i got this copper looking um reddish color and I also got um, this beige um, color, colored one. And, um, you know, they're both the same. They're made by the same brand, um, which is Heart and Hips. Um, and I got them at the retail store that I work at now. So I don't think any of these things you can find. Well, you, of course, you can find them online. But I can't give you a direct link, which is not a big deal. You know, you can go to any website such as AMI Clubwear, Fashion Nova, um, you know, little outlet stores like that. Zappo probably and find um, some of these. Okay, so the next dress was going to be um, my birthday dress and I was gonna wear it out um, to the club the night of my birthday. But the girl that I was supposed to go out with um, just never called me. So I didn't get to wear this dress, which is this pink, um, really tight dressed um it's cinched all of the sizes that i got were large um, mostly except for the exception of um a couple outfit cute at the back it's um it hugs your booty so i really like this dress this pink dress i was gonna wear this dress with a with i'll show you the accessories that i got but uh, i had a diamond choker and um, some really cute shoes to go with this. And I had planned on wearing it for my birthday, I never got the chance, but I'm gonna wear it somewhere for sure. Okay, so the next dress that I got is the one that I'm wearing right now. Um, I got this in the large, but honestly, I could have got a medium because it fits a little loose. Um, what I like about this dress is it goes all the way down to my knees. It hugs me and it um, enhances my shape. So that's what I really like about this dress really brings out the slim thick factor um jacket by heart to hips most of these clothes are by this is a 1x i didn't want the jacket to actually fit that well i want it to be a little bit loose and you know a little easier to put on so i got this jacket as well and um this is just something i can wear you know when it's like raining or if it's a nice light chill outside okay so next up is my favorite pieces in this um little birthday haul was the body suits i have a third one um that i wore already so it's dirty but it says uh, it's really cute i mean it's an it's a it's not the one that's as long as these it's got this cut off at the thigh um and it's really fitted and it says if you think i'm crazy uh, you should meet my sister. Honestly, I don't really like it that much anymore because my sisters are probably like, well, you're more crazy than us. So, no. Girl, bye. <laughs> okay, so the bodysuits I got was first up this green one. And this um, green is definitely um, in right now. This green is super trendy right now. This army green, this olive green. Um, this bodysuit fit very well. Um, it's a size large, um, and I I think what's best about this bodysuit is that it makes my shape look good. You know, I sometimes I feel like my shape is 
slim thick, but then sometimes I feel like I have, if I'm not eating properly, then I can look like SpongeBob SquarePants. And this did not bring out the SpongeBob SquarePants factor. This definitely gave me lots of shape. Um, so, love it. The next bodysuit was my favorite one, which is this red one. And the reason why I like it is because of the lace detail, or not the lace, but the string um, sew up detail in the front. Um, which I, I don't know something about that just makes it really sexy, really pop and I really like it. This material is softer and more stretchy than the green one, so I did went ahead and get this in a size medium and it fit perfectly. The next item was this yellow dress. I wore this on my birthday. I wore this the morning of, um, I, did, I cleaned up in this outfit and I also did um, my facial. I got ready, put my makeup on in this outfit. It just had me feeling nice and regal. This one does have a high slit. Um, that goes all the way up the front so super sexy and with the slides that I paired it with I just felt like a goddess in my own home like a domestic goddess really with this outfit so um, this one I did get in an extra large when I tried it on in the video for you guys it was a large and it couldn't zip up all the way in the back so I went back and I purchased an extra large specifically for my birthday because I was not going to be walking around with my back all open so I went and got the traded in for the extra large and the extra large fits perfectly okay so the next two items uh was these shorts and this see-through lace top which I loved when I saw it I knew I had to get it however the size I got was too big I got a large and so it's a little loose um, in this area where the arms are. Um, I should have gotten a medium. I don't think they have any more and I took the tag off already anyway. So I'm just gonna have to make it work. And honestly, I did have a bodysuit to wear underneath this, but the bodysuit, it just didn't go with it. It just, the bodysuit overpowered um, this and just took away from its overall beauty. So I didn't wear anything underneath. Um, I do need to find a kind of lace see-through bra to go with this. These shorts um, have a little um, lace layer. So when you shake it, bomb, bomb, shake it, bomb, bomb, shake it, bomb, bomb, uh, you get a 3D effect. So I like these a lot just to wear around the house or to, you know, make a quick run to the store. But this shirt definitely needs to be worn somewhere um, and it's not in my house. So we're gonna have to figure out where I need to wear this at. But this outfit was totally cute, totally adorable, and um, I love it. Like I said, all of these pieces I picked up at um, the retail store that I work with. So, I mean, I could tell you prices and all that, and but it wouldn't matter, you know, because the type of store that it is is something similar to like TJ Maxx or Burke's Outlet or, or um, what do they call that? You know, the, the coat outlet or whatever it's kind of like that where the pieces are not always the same and you're not gonna always find the same thing there so it doesn't really matter if I hook you up with the connections um so yeah and I don't really think I can talk about my job that much I really don't want to anyway so yeah okay so next up was this swimsuit this leopard print swimsuit it's high-waisted so it covers up my baby pudge you know after having four kids every mom has a pudge um, I need to work out more, but for now, until <laughs> I do, I'm going to be using this high-waisted uh, swimsuit to cover it up. Um, I love the bra. It's a nice little push-up bra. It's not one of those swimsuits where your titties are just hanging, and then it's like it's really pulling on your neck really hard because the string is doing all the support. You do get some support from the bust, which I do appreciate because... These titties, they've been through a lot in the past year. They need some support, especially with breastfeeding. So this was super cute. And then the coverall that um, I picked out to go with it was this coverall that says sexy. It's see-through um, and it has two uh, slits up the sides. All of these pieces were anywhere from $6.99 to 20 bucks from where I shop at. Now these next pieces I got from a different store called It's Fashion um, and that's where I'm going to start spending my money from now on. This is the last time, unless I see something very specific at my job, this is the last time I'm shopping there because as you can see those 
pieces except for the lace shirt were pretty simple pretty you know cut and dry there was really no um pop to them so you know those are the really simple pieces so here are these next couple pieces i love okay so the next piece that i got at it's fashion um this was 17.99 but it was so worth it. It's great uh, material. The detailing is super sexy. Um, and it's a nice, heavy uh, material. It's not light like all those other pieces, you know, that I shopped at for my job. This skirt is gonna last me a long time. All those other pieces that could probably last me just a year. But this skirt, at least five years. And you can see the bodysuit that I'm wearing with it. I did get that at my job. Um, the bodysuit looks like it can be worn front to back, but with the strips in the front, it's supposed to be in the back, but I put them in the front because I feel like that's where they're supposed to be. Um, and then I also got this top to go with the skirt. And uh, the arms are my favorite, of course. I just feel like a woman when I wear this top. And so it's lovely. Um, my only concern was it was a little bit small right here across the chest and on the back but other than that i love this top so the final piece in my haul was my birthday dress this was a 50 dollars dress y'all i went to its fashion um i was looking for some pink shoes to go with that pink dress i showed you guys earlier that i said i was gonna go clubbing in um and as I was walking, I bought the shoes and some accessories. And as I was walking out the store, I looked to the left and I just seen, it was just like, oh, I just seen all these beautiful pieces of clothing because the store went, the last time I was there, the section that I looked over to my left, it used to be the plus size section. And when I came back, it was no longer the plus size section. It was a junior section with much sexier clothing. And one of the pieces that I saw was my birthday dress. This was 50 bucks, and honestly, I was just sitting there contemplating, like, should I get it, should I get it, should I get it, should I get it? And I was just like, it's your birthday, your husband gave you money to go shopping, get the dress. So I ended up getting the dress, I wore this out um, at my birthday dinner, and then my husband spilled ice cream on it, and I'm like, do you know how expensive this dress is? And he's like, what, $19.99? Because he had seen me, um, I had he tried to help me zip up the yellow dress and he's seen the price tag on that. He's like, what, $19.99? I said, no, this is a $50 dress. What are you talking about? He was like, yeah, right. So I had to like pull the tag off and show him, you know, like I spent $50 on a dress. I'm definitely known for being cheap. If ask anybody, I will not spend over it's probably $39.99 on anything, on anything. So me getting this $50 dress was a big deal. And it was definitely worth it, I love it. It's obviously one of those pieces that you can't wear all the time. You know, this is something you can wear probably once a year on an anniversary or a birthday. I don't, not gonna wear it for my birthday. The next time I probably wear this dress is if I ever get to go to an anniversary dinner. Okay, so next up is accessories. Okay, so I didn't get many jewelry pieces. Um, I just got what I wanted to wear for my birthday. Um, well, this one, I don't, I wanted to wear it with this today, but I just felt like it was way too much, especially since I already have some string here. Um, so I don't know, this, this has to be worn with like a simple piece, like a, um, a black bodysuit or something that doesn't cut off at the neck. But this is obviously a really thick choker. I'm not really into thick chokers that much. Um, so I don't know if I'll even wear this, but I'm sure I will one day. I did wear it with that white, um, that cream lingerie dress. Okay, the other choker that I got was the one that I was gonna wear my birthday night, which was gonna be super kitty fied. Bring out the boss wave in me, and I love this one. Super, super cute. I love the sparkles. It's got a rainbow sparkly effect. Super cute. Okay, so then the last piece I was gonna wear with this um, choker as well. It's gonna have it like this, and then have this one kind of dangling down. Um, 
you know, that's what I was gonna do. Then I also got some, um, I wanna call them diamonds, but they're not. Acrylic, <laughs> acrylic diamond studs. Um, I got three pairs of these. These are the largest sizes, and then there's like a medium one and a small one. I also got this purse. This is the clutch I was gonna wear the birthday night with that plain pink dress. So as you can see, the dress was pretty plain, but all of my accessories were going to be popping if I did ever get the chance to wear them. I did get this at another store, which is um, Burke's Outlet. Um, the, the brand though is DiMarjo, DiMarjo, New York. Um, it also has a, a cute little chain strap to go with it. If you get tired of holding it as a clutch, you can just swing it over your shoulder and you're good to go. So then the next piece, I just picked this up um, just because it's BCBG and I seen it at my um, job. Honestly, I could wear this with this dress that I have on right now from going out to get some coffee or something like that and I don't wanna bring it up. I don't drink coffee, you know, like Starbucks, but not coffee at Starbucks, like a iced tea frappuccino, that's my favorite. I would bring my little purse, you know, like if I don't have my kids with me. Uh, I usually bring my really big purse when I have all four of my children with me. But if it's just me, I thought I could, you know, get this BCPG purse clutch, whatever, and it's more simple and easier to carry. So those are all the jewelry and the purses. Now let me show you the shoes that I got for my birthday. So the first pair of shoes that I got for my birthday, um, not to wear on my birthday, but just because it's my birthday, I bought myself some stuff. Was these sandals, they're like, they look like leaves or feathers and it's a two-tone kind of color look. You see the darker green on the top and the light green on the bottom. I thought these were unique and cute. Um, I got these in a size 10. Um, as far as like width, they're perfect, you know, like uh, across it, like my feet fit good. But as far as length, it, my feet are just a little bit too short for the size 10. But um, it works. So what do you know? I just feel like now that I'm getting older, my feet are just getting bigger for some reason. So then the next one are these cute um, rainbow colored slides. These were my perfect favorite. I wore these on my birthday during the day and I love these slides. They're just so cute, soft, and so much fun. <laughs> um, those were 10 bucks. I also got another pair in which I'm not gonna show you the other one because my daughter got, these are the ones I'm wearing right now. My daughter got lotion on it and yeah, they don't look that great, but this one does. Um, so I have to, um, oh, that kind of popping off a little bit. So I have to um, like get this washed or whatever, figure it out, but love these. Um, and I also got my girls a pair to match mine. There's our BCBG. Next up are these clear boots, which you see me wearing with the green bodysuit. These boots are definitely on trend. Um, these are super cute, love them. The only thing was, it's hard to unzip them, so I have to like stick my hand in it, move the leather out the way, or whatever it is, the pleather out the way, in order to get it zipped. But other than that, it fit great, and they're very uh, comfortable on the arch. So the next, a uh, shoe that I got, uh, these Wild Diva shoes that I wore on my birthday. These are neon yellow. I thought they matched perfectly with my butterfly dress. So I had to have them, um, yeah, self-explanatory. And then the final piece in this whole try on haul um, was, is the shoes that I was going to wear the night of my birthday with the pink dress that I told you I specifically went looking for, but I got distracted and bought a whole nother outfit, were these fuzzy cute pumps with the feather detail on the front. These make me feel like a domestic goddess, uh, like a housewife, like a boss babe. And I definitely was gonna be rocking these my birthday night, didn't get the chance, but I will rock them one of these days. I don't know where I'm gonna go or what I'm gonna do, but I will be wearing these shoes. Okay, you guys, so that's it for my try my birthday try on haul. I hope you guys liked all of these pieces. Um, I wish I could be 
uh, giving you guys a link and to connect you guys with all this stuff, but I don't think I really care about that anymore. Um, not like I'm not trying to help y'all out. It's just like me trying to sell y'all stuff. It just doesn't work. I mean, trying to sell stuff on Amazon or trying to direct y'all to this link and that link. I think you guys just like my videos just to watch. I don't know. Girls, if you do want um, links, let me know. I can find similar pieces or I can direct you to a website that has similar clothing. Okay? So, thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.